welcome to my youtube channel greetings to all my youtube viewers thank you each and every one for your sincere comments remarks reviews and your motivation today's video is going to be on why physics why students have to choose physics as their major subject since the 12th standard examinations results have come and students are in queues in big universities and colleges running around for choosing the branches of study and the degree of education your undergraduate degree postgraduate degree at what not so since there is so much of uh, you know wide spread of choosing the proper branch of study of your interest i would like to give few tips why you have to choose physics as your major subject days are gone when specialized only basic sciences are available for the students to study now we have so much of multidisciplinary courses like medical physics till biophysics till biomedical engineering you have so many specialized types of courses multidisciplinary courses above all this the basic sciences have its own importance students have lost interest in choosing physics chemistry botany zoology as your major subject but these sciences always have its own significance now i'm coming to the topic why physics i said why physics because students if you are like so much interested about maths you can take a maths as your major subject but there are many students will who will have varied interest they will not know what course to choose exactly say for example nowadays i have heard many teenagers saying that we are interested in space and technology we are interested to study about planets i want to study astrophysics more than astrophysics first we have to study the basic sciences namely basic physics so when you take basic physics as your major course in your college you all other sciences or all other concepts that you want to study will come underneath it say for example in space and technology if you are having interest so what are the what is the name of a force binding the two planets to stick on together how is that all the planets are revolving only in orbits why the planets are not coming out of the orbits and how is the uh, binding force between the planets and what makes a planet to revolve always what type of force involved what type of energy involved and what holds the planets and the universe how the universe is created the big bang theory when it was tested as i have mentioned in my previous videos on angels and demons book by dan brown there they would have tested big bang theory so what is this big bang theory so creation of universe you had different theories all that makes up physics and not only that when you are going to study about your gravitational forces you will be studying about your electromagnetic forces so when you study different types of forces different types of energy binding them so you will have a greater understanding when you have a ball you just you know you just throw the ball towards the sky what happens it comes down we say it is because of gravitation gravitational pull is making the ball to come down but if you want to give a proper velocity to the ball like almost like a propulsion motion the ball can even tear across your atmospheric uh, you know gases and it can go up and it will not come down that velocity with what you have to give the ball a push is called a escape velocity so you will study about escape velocity then the roads if you are going to turn if you are very uh, fascinated about bikes and automobiles and you can again choose physics as a basic science because you will be studying about the motion acceleration velocity momentum so with what angle you have to actually slide across the curved roads when you see a curved road there is always the it is slopy means the outer curvature of the road will be little higher than the inner curvature we call the banking roads so when a biker has to like travel with full speed he has to follow a particular angle he has to take up that angle so with what angle he has to you know take this motion around the curvy road is the angle should be theta is equal to tan inverse of v squared by rg v is the velocity with which he is traveling r is the radius of curvature g is the gra again you know gravity acceleration due to gravity so if this angle obeys properly then there will not be any skidding so every in life whatever activities we do right from the morning till the night all this is imbibed with physics when you have basic appreciation towards sciences then i would say to students can always choose physics when you have greater uh, you know greater kind of 
adoration towards the electronic devices electrical gadgets and how it is working what is the mechanism behind them then the basic science physics is very important you can always go for physics when you have some good problem solving skills you want to know about light the lenses the focal length you are more interested on optical devices you can always study optics so about nucleus about atoms what is the force behind them what is the electricity what causing electricity what is behind all this concepts then physics will be the right choice for you so students studying physics will excel with very good multi uh, you know i can, i will say multidisciplinary knowledge you will have second thing is you will have high interest towards problem solving skills in your life also so many where i in all my two year, two decades of my teaching i have seen students studying physics will be like excelling in their real life also because they can any field whether it is a movie field right from the media till your i will even say till the nasa rocketry everywhere students studying physics will be excelling whatever sector you take in whatever job sector you go a government job or you you can even go for a train booking or you know train tickets booking or uh, again airport army naval you take any sectors their students studying physics will always excel because there is always a saying that physics students will be doing more of calculations derivations the complexity among the sciences when you start grasping it again and again with a deeper insight your thought level becomes broadened and you will have very good analysis skills you can observe things easily and you can analyze in a broader spectrum and the gr- greater radar vision that you have will always help you to excel so these are only my few tips for the students who wanted to opt for physics and i will say that more than your commerce and computer science students are madly going and rushing for the for these courses and uh, you can always think of your basic physics bsc physics as always your branch of study you will develop interest and you will be excelling also thank you thank you so much